it's so cool. Oh. Is it, is it started already, or is it just, this is just... Is this the first time you've booted it up? Yes, this is the first time I've booted it up. Are you recording? I am, yeah. Okay, good. I was, I was going to wait till we got to the title screen. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, there we go. There okay. Go. Well, I'm Soylent Greg. I'm, I'm Captain <laughs> Floofers. Um, and welcome to uh, a brand new project. This is... Uh, go ahead, introduce we, it. Oh my god, I love it. I love a, it already. Today, we're going to start playing World of Horror. Uh, I've got the Switch version. Oh wow, um, you've got a physical copy. Yep. That's awesome. You can get them off Fangamer. They distribute physical that. Physical copy, what? Uh, this is a um, a uh, horror game, obviously, uh, with visuals inspired by, inspired by Junji Ito, and um, oh, yeah. and uh, kind of like uh, oh, shit. invoking like a, an old school. I should have put it like I should have put my uh, my Junji Ito uh, mangas like right back here behind me on the shelf. <laughs> I'll do that next week. Yeah, <laughs> it's gonna e etoify up your up the uh, the office for next like, week. Where is where is my copy of Uzumaki? I know it's over there somewhere. I gave it back to you at some point. I don't. I know that's all. Yeah, I know. it's on the bookshelf somewhere. All right. Oh, this looks so cool. I'm stoked. So um, I I've seen uh people play this game like the pre-release version of this game. Uh, although I don't know how much has changed since then, and uh, I've okay. never I've never played it before. Um, so, uh, let's take a look and see, would you like to cu customize your rent or your next playthroughs look? There are many pals to choose from. What's two bit and one bit? Two bit looks oh, okay. better. Uh, let's do two bit, see what the that's like. If it's your first time playing World of Horror, it is recommended that you start with the spine-chilling story of School Scissors option before trying more complex playthroughs. Okay. I guess it's the tutorial. Alright, yeah, we'll do School Scissors. Let's do it. Okay. City of Shiki, uh, Shi, uh, Shiokawa, Japan, 1980X. Something strange is happening in our town. Let's it up. There's something strange in our neighborhood. Uh, I wonder if there's somebody that we can uh, telephone for that. Roped figures can be seen gathering in the woods at night. People are going missing. Disgusting creatures are terrorizing the seaside. Must be election season. The rapid technological progress of the modern era brings comfort, but also but uh, new also new unknown threats. I thought we weren't playing SMT this time. <laughs> it sure looks like it. Old gods, malicious eldritch beings who ro ruled the earth eons ago are awakening as reality starts to crumble. Okay. Oh, now we're in an initial D. Um, armed with clues, spells, and your dwindling sanity, you will investigate mysteries across the city and in realms beyond. Okay, dope. I'm ready to investigate the realms beyond. This story. Welcome to World of Horror. Important messages will appear here. 2028, 20, 2254, you found a new item. Straight Razor! Oh, that's like real time. And you found a new item, Taiyaki. Oh, hey, yeah, it is... It is it, it 2022, is, it is, isn't it? It is 820, yeah. it's 23 now, but yeah, that's that's actual time. Right. Fuck me, okay. So, uh, what's the story? Okay, let's equip. So far. Uh, you've been following the weird cult for weeks now, barely surviving and in the encounter with the skin hag at the nursery. Was, was there some, like, required reading for this? I don't know. It's a race against time and you can't rest until our town is safe. All right, start um, the mystery combat tutorial on. Yeah, let's equip the straight razor. Can I just do that from here? Strong know... damage, speed 90, 80% chance to hit unnecessary, avoid unnecessary yeah. cuts. And what is the taiyaki? Taiyaki is food, so it's probably um, oh, okay. That's just like a health item. Food for us to eat. Um, I did read. There's a, there's a small instruction manual that came with the uh, physical version. I, I flipped through that. So I know that um, okay. slot A is where our weapons go. Um, well, I would think so, because it says no weapon right oh, now. Oh, there we go. We have equipped it. It's a little... I'm, I'm going to just say for the record, it's a little hard for me to read the text. Yeah, I, uh, I think I need to do a new layout for, like, 16x9 uh, games. 
Um, but uh, I'm 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 getting through it. It's cool. Okay. I'll I'll come up with a solution for that by next week. Um, start the mystery. Sp oh my God. Spine chilling story of school scissors. Another boy from your school has disappeared. Rumor has it a terrible woman has returned from the grave. A woman with the widest smile and the sharpest scissors. It's the slit. Uh, it's the uh, slit mouth woman. Oh shit! Yes. You knew your friend was up to something when you left you his notebook full of cryptic notes. I can send her back where she belongs, he claimed. After he too disappeared, you decided to study the notebook for clues. It details a ritual that claims to stop the wicked woman once and for all. What's the worst thing that could happen? Um, well... Escape this mystery. <laughs> Given the urban legend of the Slipmouth Woman, uh, there's quite a lot of awful things that could happen. Okay. You're missing this school is eerily quiet at this hour. If the rumors are true, you need to, to stop the tall woman with scissors, you'll need to perform a ritual to force her material form to appear in our dimension. Accomplishing this requires first the drawing of an eldritch sigil and then the lighting of holy candles. You can only hope your friend has left them somewhere around the school. Oh, so we're we're the witcher, basically, but Junji Ito witcher. Oh, here we Look, go. I, cool. I, I would not mind, like, witcher. Like, what if the witcher was... What if we were just Geralt? Or, or Geralt or whatever. What if we were... Wind's howling. <laughs> Henry Cavill, come get your boys. Gotta bring... Gotta bring the Slipmouth woman into our reality. Horson. <laughs> oh, hang on. Mary is acting strange. I need to talk with her after class. I hope she didn't attempt the ritual her... Herself. herself. Yeah. Her smudge is on Is that, it. like, crossed out? Oh, okay. I've... This sigil can weaken the demon for a while. Careful with the lines. I've hidden the candles in one of the classrooms. Tomorrow I will try to perform the ritual. Okay, so the candles are in one of the classrooms. Okay. This uh, soundtrack is badass, by the way. Yeah, let, me, let me turn it up on mine. My headphones here. There we go. It's plenty loud on mine. It's actually... I'm hoping... The test video was good, right? Yeah. Because... Uh, on my end, the the sound on the switch is like slightly louder than than you are, but I mean that's okay. I don't have a problem with that. Yeah, it's 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 balanced a little bit better on on my end. Cool. Um, so the the switch is probably going to be a little bit le a little bit quieter than uh, or at least like we're 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 going to be louder than the switch is basically. That's absolutely fine. As long as it's good for the uh, the audience, then however it is for me, I I don't care. Like I said, the last LP we did. Um, you know the SMT. I couldn't hear the game sound at all, so this is a tremendous improvement. Yeah, we found a, we found out how to uh, to split that all the all the tracks up the way that we need to in in uh, in OBS, so that mm -hmm. Greg can hear everything, but also it's I not can. going to double up on on the on the recording. So that's good. Um, it's funny because the um, the the one bit like the color palette thing, and then this soundtrack really is is reminding me a lot of downwell uh <laughs> you know downwell does have that kind of look to it to be fair it does this soundtrack feels very downwell at least so far. i'm kind of hoping there'll be like a like a like a cga or like a you know with like the the with like the magenta and cyan oh hell yeah i i, I kind of want that <laughs> to be fair um, so are, are we like making it says explore. Oh, okay. Those are the decisions. Okay. Yeah. I'm like, how are we like progressing here? So we've got, uh, look at your stuff, explore school, perform the ritual, which I'm not going to do. Perform the ritual, check out school lockers. Uh, let's check out okay. the, uh, the lockers first. Let's check out the lockers. Yeah. Okay. They have symbols on them. Okay. You retrieved an item from storage. That's when what? I, that's when I took the, uh, the diary out of storage. Okay. All right. We've got. One, uh, two, three different lockers yeah, we can, to check. We can look at the ones with the symbols um, on them. Okay. Um, so should we the just one go... on the far left looks like a sword. The one in the the second one looks like the um, that it looks symbol like a bee. that looks like the that looks like the symbol from um, from the from the binding of Isaac when um, when you're the winged guy and you get the oh, okay I'll, laser thing. I I'll know there's a name for, for that symbol. Yeah, I'm awful at this. Um, yeah, let's just go from left to right. 
Okay, I was, I was saying, should we go from left to uh, left to right or pick one? Because I don't, because I don't know if what, what if what happens if something happens in between us checking lockers and like the other ones aren't accessible or something. Um, let's check the one with the okay, sword. Well, let's pick the one with the sword. Oh, uh, Jesus. what's that? I I don't know. Um, <laughs> that looks like a sarlacc pit in a locker. Uh, let's like... let's not pick that one. Um. Well, in fact, I'm gonna Can pick... we even click it again? Um, Can we even click it again, or is it just? Yeah, no, it's just. I don't. I don't know. Uh, our. Did we take damage? I think we took reasoning damage. I think that's um, this is like the, these two stats are like our health. Like this is our physical health. This is our mental health right here. Uh, stamina okay. and reason. I think. Um. So we took reason damage. Uh. So it's sort of like um, Disco Elysium. Uh, your I character guess. has two. Your character has two health bars in Disco Elysium. They have a physical health bar and a morale bar. Oh, okay. And em embarrassing yourself really badly in uh, in Disco Elysium damages your character's morale and can give you a game over. I was thinking of like um, I played Call of Cthulhu one time, like the tabletop Call of Cthulhu game, and it had mm -hmm. like a sanity meter. So I think that's what that's 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 uh, okay. That's doing there. Um, All right, which one do you want to open next? Uh, the one that's as far away from whatever the fuck that is as possible. <laughs> let's do it. Okay, I need a key to open that one. You need um, a tiny key to open the locker. Okay, uh, let's check the heart one. All right. Pardon me, sir. The heart. Heart five. Bat. Oh, there's a baseball bat. All right. Okay, so we found get... a new item, wooden bat. Okay, it's already in our in our inventory, so I can use that, I guess, when the uh... when the uh... what kind of um. What kind of uh, stats does the bat have compared to the razor? Uh, let's take I'm going to assume look. it's probably not as... Is damage yeah, 4, 4 damage, 80, 80 speed, 70, percent 70 percent chance, chance to, hit. to hit. What do we... What's the... That doesn't seem as good as the straight razor, I don't think. Because the straight razor is also 4, but it's 90 speed and 80 chance to hit. Yeah, I'll stick with the straight razor for now. And if that breaks or something like that, we'll switch to the bat. The only thing that worries me is that, like, avoid unnecessary cuts thing. It almost makes it sound like there's a slight chance we could, like, injure ourselves with the straight razor That's while a good using point. it. Yeah. But we'll see. We'll see. Okay. All so right. we check the lockers. Check the lockers. Let's explore the school. Yep. We <laughs> obviously were not ready to... Oh, my God. That's adorable. We're obviously not ready to uh, perform the ritual yet. As you enter the school gym, you notice a strange black doll propped up against the wall. We can come, come closer, closer or yeah. needs anatomy class per. I don't think that we have that. Where's our... Uh, th let me see if there's a way that we can check our stats or something. Is it? Do I click on myself or... Options. Sta oh, Options, status. Here we go. Status. Spells. Oh, we have spells? Uh, evidently. <laughs> um, I guess we don't have any perks. Uh, otherwise, I don't know if they'd probably show up in here or something. It would probably pop up there. Yeah, what are our spells? Do we have a spell? Uh, we don't have any spells. No. Oh, we have, oh, we cauterize. have cauterize. Click it. What does it do? I don't want to accidentally cast it or something. Um, cauterize. Support healing. Oh, uh, it's a healing spell. Plus two stamina, one time use only. Okay. Okay, cool. So we have a basic ass healing we have spell. A, we have a free heal, and we also have that Taiyaki, which I assume uh, will heal us as well. I don't like this doll, but I don't see an option to I don't leave. See an so option I think we should to... get closer to the doll. Okay. Against your better judgment, you approach the doll. What you see makes you gasp in horror. The doll isn't a doll. Uh, your sudden movement causes Ooh. tiny black spiders to flee, revealing a white, half-eaten corpse. Minus two reason oh, damage. She's horrifying. We should call the police. I feel like something horrible Plus is happening. Plus the chalk not found. Yeah, we need the chalk and candles. Okay, so we don't have the chalk, we don't have the candles. We must hurry and find those items. All right, well, I so guess... Wait, what are our options now? Uh, same options as before, so I guess if we go, uh, click to explore if school, we, we'll... If we click lockers, do we go to the same lockers, or is it a new set of lockers? Sorry, I'm just trying it's, to figure out how this works. Okay, it's the same, it's the same lockers, lockers, yeah. Okay, we definitely need to find the key and open that locker. I feel like either the chalk or the candles or something is hidden behind that, but... Yeah. Yeah, let's explore the school some more. Investigating classroom. You hear a faint sound while walking outside Anatomy. the biology classroom. 
Uh, inside is an old anatomy model. It's heart beating. The sight almost makes you sick. We take one stamina Ooh. damage. Uh, you find an okay. additional page from your friend's diary. It seems the blessed chalk was left on the roof. Something evil so stalks much. the... Oh, I... Ooh, that doesn't sound good. Ooh, I think there's something... There's a new option, isn't there? Uh, peek outside? Uh, should we peek outside? or Will the explore school take us to the roof? Um... I think let's peek outside. We got a new option. Let's try it. Okay. Let's try right. to open the door, select and hold the cursor on the door handle, then drag the cursor. Oh, it's interactive. Oh, it's I because like it. there's something evil in the corridor, so we... Oh, I don't like that. Oh, no, 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 thank you. Hell, I don't nah. the nah, sir. Uh -uh. <laughs> I got a, I got a straight ways a bitch. Nah, you can, uh, you can, you can, nah, you can, <laughs> nah. <laughs> you, you stay there and I'll stay here. Uh oh. Something oh no, wrong. it's Hellstar Remina. Blue sky. <laughs> Instead of a clear blue sky, you see the bloated corpse of a long forgotten deity looming over the school's roof. The barrier between worlds is coming apart. You must hurry or risk being noticed by whatever other ultra horrors still lurk here. So try to sneak or run. I mean, I think we would we should run. It says you should hurry. Um, um yeah, up to you. But damn, that is awesome. Nothing looks freaky. All right. Uh... Oh, drifting classroom. I like that. Nice reference. That's not drifting classrooms. Not um, even Ito, is it? It's no. it's a different uh, horror manga. I yeah, it's, a, it's completely different. The, yeah, I haven't read it, but I know the, I know the, of it. I've read the first volume of Drifting Classroom. Yeah, I'm, I'm fairly it's good. I'm fairly sure it isn't Ito though. No, it's it's like his name's like it starts with like a U. It's weird. It's like U M E S, and there's like a Z in it. Or something I don't know. Someone in the comments, you you, you let everybody know. All right, what do you want to do? Uh, you want to sneak or run? Skate or die? I don't know. We, die, we, die, 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 die. we have a low low deck, so I don't know if sneaking will be something that we can. Yeah, I think we should just book it, man. I mean, I, that eye is freaky. I'm running from that shit. Yeah, let's run. Strength check success. I gotta get this fucking game. You succeed in grabbing succeed. the backpack and return to the staircase leading back to your world. Ten experience. Holla! We survived. You found Blessed Chalk. You found Blessed Chalk. Which you can use to draw the, sig the sig sigil in your ritual. You copy the sigil as best you can on the blackboard. Hopefully it'll be enough. Awesome. Okay, so what was one and two? Redraw sigil. sigil. And something else. Uh, I know that that's not the else. sigil because the, uh, the diary, if you remember, showed that. Yeah, it's like a square. Uh, yeah. So let's, let's can we redraw the sigil? That one looks closer. There it is. Let me just make double sure. Is that... That looks pretty damn close. That looks pretty damn close. Uh, let me see if there's any other options for two. Okay, that, that's, that's, oh, that's yeah, no, the one. That's the closest one. Yeah, that's the one. That's the one. It should be correct Okay, so we now. got the right okay. sigil, I think. Okay, right, so let's so explore the school and find the, and candles. Find the holy candles. Investigating the gym. We were just in the gym, gym already. Oh, hi there! Hello! A tall woman with an Hello. unsettling face and twitching lips stops you. I'll be your new b biology teacher. Could you help me move some stuff to my new office? Patrick? Yes? Bloofers? Yes. I think she wants us. She wants us to go into the office, but look at that face. That is the face of seduction, my friend. <laughs> that... That crooked smile, that lopsided gaze, that is the look of a teacher who wants herself a forbidden liaison with a, <laughs> with, with, with whoever our name is. I don't remember our name. I think she's our biology teacher, dude. She wants to teach us some biology. Um, I don't know if you put it, if you it. put it that way, if you want to do it, okay. Yeah, let's do it. All right. Luck check success. Your creepy, the creepy substitute teacher hands you some gold books to carry. Among the mundane titles, you find one called Extinction of Mankind. You shudder, feeling the teacher's gaze on your back. Plus five experience. 
The sound of scissors is getting louder. You must hurry. We got a book. Wait, is it? Oh, we don't actually have it. In we our, don't actually have uh, the book. Inventory. I think it was just it's an just, event. We just got XP. The sound of scissors is getting louder. You must hurry. Okay, we got to keep exploring then, I guess. Yeah, we need to find Unless, the candles. There... Yeah, we can't do the ritual without the holy candles. No, we already saw Anatomy that. Fence. We saw you oh. already. Oh, we saw. We found the holy candles in the friend's backpack. You lit them as instructed by the notebook. Everything is ready for the ritual. Is there a way All to right, save? Let's do it. Um, I kind of want to save. Options. Uh, ooh, pallets. Oh, here we go. Oh, hello. There's a Game Boy one. Oh, I. I dig the Game Boy one, but I, it doesn't look right on the on the thing. I, that's what I would use if I was playing the game, but... Mm. I like that one. Um, there's a lot of these. Yeah, there are. Holy shit. Kind of black. Old print. Deep gold. Uh, I'm... I'm... I'm, I'm uh, that's... Like, I'm not even seeing half of these because you're flipping through them and before it can load, it's on to the next one. But you pick you pick whatever one you want. Oh, okay. Some of them are skipping, it looks like. Well, maybe not. Blood. Definitely not that dark red one. That one looks just like mud on the I'm kind of looking for one that's like, like I was mentioning, like, like the cyan and, and magenta. Oh, 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 I like Leatherface. That's nice. Yeah, that's good. Uh, you don't have to pick that one. You look for the cyan and magenta. But, uh, yeah. yeah. I'm making mental notes when I inevitably purchase many, this game. How many are these? <laughs> oh, that's the, last, that's the last one it'll go to. Uh, I couldn't find one. Okay. Okay, I'll just Let's keep it on standard. standard for now. All right. Sorry about that, folks. Uh, what is this? Extra math displayed. Extra math displayed. What is the UI plus? Extra information. Extra information displayed. I'd like extra information, okay. please. Uh, I yeah. guess we don't have the ability to save, so. Yeah, I don't see a save. What about that A B C D E up there? Up at the top. Uh, I... Those aren't likes. I have no idea. Okay, shit. Um, I was like, are those, like, saves? You know, it, prob thought? it probably doesn't let us save because it is a roguelike, so that that, would, that would make sense. Um, okay, let's ritual it up then. All right, let's do the thing. Here we go. Do the thing. Wait, what's that? Wait, what's that? Ooh. Continue. Techie, techie, techie. <laughs> you st take a step you back. You take a step back. Oh. <laughs> As a writhing, amorphous mass slowly takes shape. Soon it becomes a tall woman-like creature with three faces, all connected by a wide smile. Now is your chance. <laughs> now is your chance to fight, fight and defeat this horror. It is also your only chance. This is your chance. Your only chance. Twitching and uh, twitching and uh, twisting and twitching, the demon woman enters the classroom, cackling menacingly. menacingly Am I beautiful? Oh, yeah. So this is, yeah, this, I wonder if it's going to actually follow. Oh, no, it's just going to be combat. Okay. Combat tutorial. During each turn, you'll build a sequence of attacks and moves from the action ring, B. Once you've filled the sequence bar, C, we'll press the launch sequence button to finish your turn. Build the combat sequence white bar with combat moves and press the launch sequence to attack your enemy. Clear, delete the last combat move. Damn, girl, how the hell you eat with that? Be falling from one mouth to the next mouth? Alright, so... Which... She ate one too many impossible burgers. So I guess this. Offensive actions. And then what are the other... There's... I don't know. Oh, the, none of those work. Okay. It would be really funny if it, it, there was like a timer and you exceeded it, and it was just like yeah, that would be your funny face off. All right, um, 
Okay, so what if we got letting two... me? It's not letting me put into C. Hold on. Wait, so this is C, right? This is the is this is the action. Oh, here we go. Yeah, that's the action right there. You got kick and. Oh, is that just, it? I guess. I have a weapon equipped, so I don't know why I'm not using the weapon. Uh, so, kick. Kick, kick, punch. It's kick. all in the mind. Kick, kick, kick. You slammed your penis in the car door. <laughs> okay, let's see what this does. Kick, kick, kick. Well, I did some punching, too, apparently. Oh, you've got more shit now. He slashes at with me time, with time, you will discover new combat moves available through the action filter. But first, you need a weapon. Look and choose an action there called... There we go. Attack with Find and choose an action called Look for an Improvised Weapon. You don't need an improvised weapon. We've already got a weapon. Okay, so... Attack with your weapon. So that... Strong attack. Strong attack. Oh, yeah, definitely do that. And, uh... What's this down here? Attack boost. You need a boost. firearm to perform this action? Oh shit, we're gonna have guns. Hold, hold on, can I use this? Can I do like attack boost? Strong attack. Duck wizard spell of shoot you in the face! I may be out of spells, but I'm not out of shells. Fuck yeah. Let's do a prepare attack, attack boost, strong attack. I wouldn't be able to get a, a second attack in, but this stro the the strong attack here is going to be guaranteed to hit. Okay. Okay. I also got to keep an eye on my health and shit too. Menacingly. Okay. Oh, that just gives me... Uh, that gives you reason. That gives me reason. I mean, it, she is taking reason away from me as well. Yeah. You want to hit back, okay. B, B to go back. I was just seeing how to use it. Um, oh, okay. Because I might want to heal myself before too long. Because it's got cauterized steel stamina, right? Yes, he has two stamina. Yeah. Um, let's do strong attack, regular attack. Actually, okay. boost, strong attack, regular attack, because I can do that. Let's see how well that works. Go for it. I miss both. Shit. Have you covering the wall in blood? Wait, let's try it again. Jeez. All right. Oh, I win. Oh. You defeated Scissor Woman. 15 experience. The ancient horror lies dead on the classroom floor, slowly dissolving into nothingness. You find your friend gravely wounded but alive. You help him up, and both of you limp away from the school as the police sirens get louder. Spine-chilling story of school scissors. Ending A. Hey, we did it. We won the tutorial. Yeah, the horror, horror is over for now. Incoming Doom, 4%. That's not the only mystery plaguing this town. You must continue your investigation. Okay. Whoa. Oh, it's, it's, uh... Oh, it's doing this okay, again. It's, it's restarted. Okay. okay. Oh, here we go. The horror. Alright, um... Okay, the options are the same. I don't want to disable extra effects, so the extra effects are fine. Yeah. Okay, so this is just all the same. That's cool. What's extra? Oh! Hello! Oh, it's like achievements and bestiary and stuff. Okay. Oh, nice. Alright, well, I guess we're going to do a new story. Stick with 2-bit. Okay, so what do we got? 
We got Spine Chilling Story of School Scissors. We got Extracurricular Activity. So that's the standard playthrough. Quick play. And quick play. This will start a new playthrough, randomly selecting character, old god, background, and more. Okay. Or I can fully customize the playthrough. Apparently that's the complexity of three. And then I have a locked option. Um, okay. Now, if I, if I, I remember... Probably... Yeah, go ahead. If I remember correctly, the extracurricular activity, that's like the standard playthrough, that actually can go over multiple chapters. Um, okay. So that's probably like what I would consider, like if I clear that, then that would, I would consider that to be a game clear for me. Okay. Um, so I think that's what I'm going to go ahead and do is that. I was going to jokingly tell you that, you know, now you now you can put in the game clear. <laughs> took us 26 minutes to beat that game. That game kind of sucked. We beat it in less than a half hour. Okay, it's the same intro. The thing forsaken by God. Banished to another, the other dimension a long time ago. I love the title. Goizo has found a way to use mirrors to ensnare and teleport its prey straight through the reflective glass. It's Kamen Rider Ryuki. Uh, the glimpses behind your reflections are just the beginning of a real nightmare. Old God's rule, resting at home raises doom. Um, uh, the doom, oh, and I do know that the doom meter, if it reaches a hundred, if it reaches a hundred percent, we, we lose. We have okay. to, we have to clear, I think the A, B, C, and D are the, the five chapters that we have to clear. We actually have okay. to clear all five chapters before the doom reaches a hundred percent. Before the doom reaches a hundred percent, Okay. If the Doom reaches 100%, then uh, it starts playing Dope Smoker by Sleep through the speakers, and you have to follow the smoke to the rift-filled land. Oh, I was hoping that we would just get to play Doom. <laughs> that's, that's the other side of that <laughs> joke. See, I immediately thought Doom Metal. You thought... <laughs> Alright, yeah, let's do this. Okay. Let's find Continue. the thing forsaken by God. First time playing, select this. First time this. playing, select this. Welcome and thank you for trying World of Horror. Inspired by adventure games from the 80s, the visual overload may be a little disorienting in the beginning. In this short tutorial, I will do I my best to explain true. various elements to prepare you to fight the horrible old gods. Pavel, uh, creator of the game. Thank you, Pavel. This is the main game screen. Here you will interact with your surroundings, solve mysteries, and fight enemies. All performed actions will be added to the log down there. I'm a bit concerned that you're already dead on the left-hand side of the screen, your little helper. No, they're fine now. That's you on the right. World of Horror has RPG elements, and your attributes are described by the six basic stats. Hover, move your closer cursor over them to learn more. Uh, strength. Um... We, we know what strength and dexterity are, game. We're not total noobs. Funds that, they, that 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 last one there that there's money. Well, that's money. Uh, and the rest of these are just for certain events, like they have to be a certain level to. And then obviously this is physical health and stability and will to confront the horse once it reaches zero. Okay. All right. All right. That's the inventory. You can keep... <laughs> what? I love the zombie version of our guide with the gun and the bloody knife. I fucking love the art style in this game, man. Yeah. We can keep up the four items in our inventory. I think the um the instruction book will said this too. And then our equipment really slots. We should have done this at the beginning of the scissor mouth woman, the slip mouth woman chapter. Yeah. As you progress with your playthrough, more helpful tips will appear. Will, tips will appear. Would you like to turn the tutorial com on? Um, we already did the t uh, the combat tutorial. Yeah, I mean, it's up to you uh, if you want to see it again. I'll cool. leave it on just to be on the safe side. Uh, let's see. Important messages will appear here. Let's go to my home. Check the mailbox. It's empty. And there's something banging on the inside of the mailbox. Hello. Hello. Okay. Back in your home, I'll you your next move. Will you are currently investigating any near your investigatory? Recent newspaper clippings and notes collected in the next room should point you in the right direction. Okay. I guess we can change clothes, apparently. 
I don't know if we want to be standing in front of the mirror knowing what we know now, but like... Okay, so like standard clothes, I guess that's like a high school gym uniform. <laughs> yeah, do you think the thing forsaken by God can watch us change our clothes? Oh my god, of course we have the schoolgirl outfit. Well, I mean, we're a schoolgirl, so it makes sense. You know, it does. Uh, take a bath, watch this TV. This would be the weirdest game to have fan service. Take a peep through peephole. I know it exists, though. Oh. Oh my god. I don't, oh. I don't, I don't, I don't like that. I, I love it. I don't like that. <laughs> I don't like the peephole. Hell no. <laughs> Alright. Um, uh, cool. Right, do we have anything in our storage? We do not have anything in our storage. And that that looks completely as one mystery to save progress. I was gonna say that looks like a floppy disk. I'm like that's probably the save the save function. So we have to complete Start at least one mystery. mystery first. Okay, so let's see if that's starting a mystery. Inexplicable and morbid events have been plaguing your town for some time now. You've tr marked down five of them, hoping there is a, so there's something connecting them. You can tackle these five mysteries in any order you want. Beware, your decisions will haunt you and influence yet unsolved mysteries. Okay. So are they all the thing forsaken by God, I guess? Or is that like the eldritch being that animates this entire campaign, I guess? That uh, the the old god is like is like the final boss, basically. That's the one who we're okay. trying to stop ultimately. So what are our five options? Uh, well, we've got... we have four options at least. We have vicious verses of a violent vigil, rotten report okay. of a rancid ramen, cr a chilling chronicle of a crimson cape, and alarming account of abnormal arms. Um, I love this game, man. This is so cool. Uh, uh, we we can re-roll them if you go? want. <laughs> we can re-roll them if you want. Oh, we can re-roll? Um, I don't know. I kind of like the abnormal arms. Right. That's Yeah, let's do abnormal like, arms. What the fuck? I'm sure we have the sanity for abnormal arms. I remember when it... Alarming account of abnormal <laughs> arms! I remember when it started. Rem oh, sorry. <laughs> The woman next door was strangled to death in her bed with no sign of forced entry. The killer was never found, and the apartment remained vacant. To advance this mystery, investigate the circled location. As you progress, the location and rules may change. You can't investigate your home. You can't investigate your home? Not with that attitude. Alright, the door to the apartment has closed and shields alone. Where the other ways are... In are there maybe you can get to the apartment plan to compare with the other flats investigate the hospital location twice to complete the quest okay so there are like side quests and shit interesting oh shit we have no weapon yeah i think the tutorial this just kind of like yeah the tutorial i think just kind of like started us off with some basic shit this one is just yeah, saying this isn't like the tutorial yeah this is just saying good fucking luck <laughs> um, reminds me a little bit of Pathologic, where the um, sort of the the easy mode, and as much as that game has an easy mode, is the Bachelor, who um, starts out with like a scalpel and uh, a decent reputation among the people, and then you start the uh, the Haruspics, and it's like you got the shit beaten out of you. You have nothing, and everyone in town hates and fears you. Well, we can go to a shop. We can shop for items, but that it'll it'll increase our doom counter if we do. Okay. We don't want to increase our doom counter. I mean, I think we're going to have to, because, I mean, the doom counter is going to go up over time as well. No, I get that, but, like, we shouldn't unless we I, have I, it's to. Like a, it's like a risk-reward sort of thing. Yeah. We can go to the police. Let's just tell the cops... Uh, about the mysterious arm um, person, I'm, and then go home. Now let's at least um, wait until we have a little bit more money before we go shopping. Anyway, well, let's let's travel What's to the, the hospital. What's the thing that's circle? What's the thing that? Oh, downtown circle. Um, oh yeah, let's investigate the hospital. Okay, let's investigate the hospital. Since that's like a a quest. Okay, investigating consulting. Aww. Room. 
You meet with your friend who has recently started her nurse practice. You lazily chat on the roof of the hospital watching the sunset. Now would be the perfect opportunity to ask about the recent unearthly events. Ask about them or don't ruin the calm moment. Um... So what about those arms? <laughs> How about them arms, friend? Have you heard about the abnormal arms? Her stories about missing patients, mysterious surgeries, and strange infection are helpful, but they kill the mood. You must leave this place. Plus 10 experience, minus 2 reason. Sounds awesome. That doesn't kill the mood at all. Alright. Hey, you want to do it one more time? No, Complete the I guess, quest? I guess to investigate, uh, let's investigate the sick room. While taking an elevator, elevator you get you take a you get a terrible feeling something bad as something bad is about to happen. The elevator's open. Oh hi! Luck check failure. <laughs> elevator doors open, revealing a mass of eyes and teeth pouring into the elevator, biting and suffocating you. Later, you woke wake up in a doctor's office. A nurse discovered you lying unconscious on the elevator floor. Minus three reason. <laughs> hang on, hang on, hang on. I just want to point out that ruining our friend's lunch break cost two reason getting attacked by a writhing mass of teeth and waking up in the doctor's office later cost a slightly more reason than wrecking the vibe also wrecking the vibe gives us experience the, the anatomical museum archive displays a specimen with elongated arms and jellified bones also minus one reason we don't got a lot of reason here um Okay, well then... We don't have any other leads, <laughs> I don't think. I would say go to downtown, because that's circled. Alright, let's investigate here then. Investigation is starting to take a toll on your health. You feel like you're about to fall asleep standing up. How do you address your weakened state? Take a nap, buy a coffee, jog around the block. Uh, needs hot bath skills. So we can't do that fourth one, whatever it is. Uh... I'm going to say get a cup of coffee. I mean, that's what I would do. I'm sort of answering most of these how I would answer them. That's fair. Um, including trying to seduce the, <laughs> the <laughs> eldritch <laughs> biology teacher. Uh, I mean, buy a coffee would probably oh be the mo it would probably be the most Oh my goodness, Miss Wagnagel Fatagen. I'm just an innocent young student. <laughs> I mean, buying the coffee seems to be the more sensible thing to do in the situation anyway. Double Frappe Cappuccino is a nice pick-me-up, minus one funds. Okay, so we didn't lose anything, but we... Oh, the apartment uh, is on the third floor. There is no way somebody used the window to escape the murder scene. All right, let's uh, go to the uh, apartments and investigate. As you prepare a bath, you think about all the possible leads so far. You're very tired, so maybe an ice cold well, maybe ice cold water is a good idea. Uh -huh. Um Cold water or hot water. I mean if we're tired, I guess cold bath might be good. Strength check failure! Your body clearly wasn't prepared for a cold bath and you feel cold coming on. Minus two stamina. No, you notice the odd placement of ventilation shafts. They seem too small for anyone to crawl through, though. Okay. Uh, I guess keep investigating the apartments, then. Venetian Society. That pair has been following you since morning. You finally managed to lose them, but can't shake the feeling that it will only get worse. Minus two stamina. What is that over on the side there with neighbor? Like, no, down it says neighbor. Yeah, I can talk to the neighbor. You knock oh, on your friends. Talk to the neighbor. Yeah, you knock on your friends door and wait. Hey, I'm really busy today. Let's hang out some other time, okay? Uh, oh, I like your Dorito jacket. That doesn't do anything. Poke him in the face. I'm undressing the neighbor. Or something the police miss. Well, I tried interviewing the neighbors, and he didn't want to talk to me. Um... Yeah, I didn't want to...
want to do that. Okay, we'll try again some other time. Let's see here. I mean, I don't see any reason to travel to the forest or the village. Or the mansion. Um... Investigate one more time. Let's see what happens. Okay. Wandering through an empty corridor, you, rec you find an old vending machine. You re don't recognize the brands of soda inside, but you could really use a drink. cheapest one. You buy an off a can of off-brand soda when you reach for it. Something inside the machine catches your hand. Oh. You have to jerk your hand out, injuring yourself. Coughing blood. Coughing blood. Coughing blood. What? Coughing blood. One neighbor is complaining that about... that soda her. machine had a nail or a little piece of glass. Little piece of glass. <laughs> little piece of glass. <laughs> Um, we should probably get that looked at. Um, Why are we seeing boobs? I don't know. One na one neighbor's complaining about her missing underwear. Oh, okay. Um, now try talking to the neighbor. Nah, they're really busy today. But let's hang out some other time. Um, okay, let's. I mean, let's go somewhere else. I guess. I'm. I at least want to go to the hospital and see. I know it's going to cost me some doom to enter, but I want to heal injuries because. Okay. okay. You wait patiently in the reception area. You still have some time to before you're asked to the office. Doctor's office. Move to corridor A. I guess under doctor's office. The emergency department is crowded as a result of the weird happenings in your town. Your final answer. How can I help you today? Additional actions available on the injury cards. Okay. Uh, oh, yeah. Okay. Click it. Available actions. Ah, oh, there we sure go. That. Should I be worried? There we go. Okay. Wait, it says blood loss. Well, there's nothing I can do about that, I guess. Okay. Okay. All right. Cool. So that worked. I can't help but feel like I, I should keep in investigating the apartments, but I do know that investigating just brings up, like, random events. Yeah. I mean, I don't... I, I can't really... Maybe we should go home and... Can you go home and, like, go to bed? Like, to pass time, maybe that would let your... And then come back the next day and your neighbor will... I think... I don't, I don't know I don't know if that, you know, passes time like that. I do know that it, it heals us. Okay. Uh, but also... But it also increases our doom. Uh, and I think that the doom is also... it also affect, It's also affected by the, the particular old god that we're dealing with right now. Okay. I don't, I don't know, how do I talk to Booba Lady? Can I talk to Booba Lady? Booba Lady. Oh, Booba Lady. Um. Oh, travel to apartments. There you go. Now, neighbor. Right. Let's... No. He's unhelpful. Fuck. All right. You've been a neighbor. So, neighbor's unhelpful. Because I'm thinking, like, down in this corner are just, like, um, like, standard things that you can do, like, mm -hmm. in that location, like, regardless of what's going on. Okay. Apartment threat level. Oh, that's the threat level. No modifiers to skill checks. Okay, what other areas we got? Downtown. Downtown. Okay, click, just, yeah, hospital, um, school, what's school do? School. Schoolyard, library, okay, hospital, forest, nothing there. Forest is just there. Hardware shop, seaside. Well, that's a place where I can buy weapons. There, yeah. Mansion, that's just a place. 
village. Yeah, village is just a place. Just a place. So it looks like downtown is the only one. the village. Are you sure? Yeah, let's just see what happens. This is the first time we've ever tried, like, an actual investigation in this game. An old man stops you and invites you to his house. You follow reluctantly, only to be amazed by the number of dusty old sorcery books inside. I can teach you a thing or two about magic, he says. Don't worry about payment. I'm sure we'll work it out in the future. All right, let's learn some magic. All right. Oh, long success. Nonsensical stories the man told you. You've caught one thing that could be the truth. Gain a spell. Okay. Oh, we got to gain absorb. a spell. There you go. You learn your spell absorb. Deal Combat three. offensive damage gain to stamina cost for reason. Okay, so we burn reason to gain back stamina. Interesting. I'm thinking investigate downtown because it's the only one with a threat level higher than one. Okay. Okay, let's let's check out downtown then. Oh, downtown. actually, it looks like the um the the threat meter actually mod. Uh, uh, okay, the threat the meter gives modifiers to skill checks. That's what that means. Okay. So it's my minus one to skill checks if we investigate here. It's been almost a year since childhood since a childhood friend moved away to another city. He suddenly left without saying goodbye. In a recent letter, he apologized for the disappearance and asked you to remove the furniture from his flat because he wanted to sell it. In the envelope, you, get, you find a key to his apartment. Uh, help your friend. Well, nothing could go wrong here. You find another letter behind a wardrobe. It explains the reason that your friend was well, the friend left was that the shadow people were stalking him. You shudder when you realize you haven't seen the moving company tri truck driver's face plus five experience. Uh. I can trade experience for funds, but I need experience to level up. Yeah. Allies and perks. None. Town status. You. Right. Cool. Um. So I... I literally have no idea what the game wants me to do. I mean, I guess we should just keep investigating. Alright, well, I'm gonna keep investigating at the apartments because that's where the circle is. Okay. And I remember it saying that investigate at the circle. While looking around for the ransacked room of your recently deceased friend, you discover a half-finished painting of a woman, her skin a ghastly pale yellow color. The scene is disturbing. You struggle to look at it. Charisma check failure. Intimidated by the unsettling portrait, you're haunted by nightmares minus two reason. Cool. Oh. Your neighbor's complaining about weird noises coming from the vents when she's at home. Neighbor? Okay. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna check the neighbor anymore. Uh, he is very unhelpful. He's so a piece of shit. Let's just keep investigating <laughs> here. Passing by okay, a this seems... Okay, this seems like canon, if that makes any sense. Well, um, this seems useful. Passing by a faulty elevator, its door suddenly opened. You take a step back, noticing a weird, tall woman standing in the darkness. Do you live here? I've oh my never God, it's seen... Oh <laughs> never seen you. Oh! Oh! Is that an oh, Uzumaki it's reference? Oh, shit. Cyclops, neighbor! Brother, you got some big teeth. Alright. This is, uh, this is when Domino's expanded into Japan. They made a very terrifying version of the Noid. <laughs> it was a hit, though. Oh, we don't have a fucking weapon! We do not. We're gonna do some kicks, though. So, uh, may as well... Yeah, let's kick... Kick the neighbor. There we go. It punches me in the face. They punch me in the face. Shit. Okay. Okay, there should be like a uh, search for improvised weapon or something. Uh, let's see. 
I don't see anything like that. I just see like prepare. The only thing I can do are prepare my attack, uh, attack boost, and kick. Really? What about the bottom left hand one? That's like a gradient. Bottom. In the grid of att the attacks and that's shit. Oh, that's not. Nothing. That's not anything. Okay. Um. Oh, here we go. But first, you need a weapon. Find and choose an action called "Look for an improvised weapon." It's in the combat tutorial. What the fuck? Where is it then? Uh, is it under support? It might be under oh, these. Is it, it might be a. Uh, yeah. Okay. Cool. Well, okay. There there's go. other. There's other things. Okay. Combat skill lowers your experience by five and raises their chance. Okay. Assess the situation. Seems... Look for an improvised weapon. Look for an improvised weapon. There we go. Uh... Hold on. I'll, I'll assess the situation first. Maybe this will give me like some stats for the, like like a health bar or something for it. Okay. Then I'll look for an improvised weapon. Cool. Let's do it. We've got a broken bottle. Look, a nice. new item has appeared in the upper right corner. That's in your inventory. Find it and equip. Cool. Equip. All right. Okay, now we can so get gonna... the shit out of it with our broken bottle. We're gonna go Stella on him. Sir, I am about to get stabby. Right, so Stab that motherfucker like three times. Oh, the enemy seems to be weak against this type of weapon. Nice. So I think you well, they're should weak just against hit it with well, the weapon. they weak against fire, is what it says. No, it says in the um, in the the combat log there, right before you slash. Oh, like, oh okay. The I see. Yeah, I see that there. seems to be weak against this type so of weapon more plus damage. damage. Oh, and the, yeah, it does give me like a hit point. Uh, like it has one hit point left. Ah. All right. So that was a good thing to do. She's already devoured one of your neighbors. Will you be next? Let's see. I was just, uh... Well, it only has one HP left, so I'm just gonna, like, make sure that this hits. Yeah. There we go. Let's check the building plan to find out if there's a place where the vents connect. Okay. Wired Preacher, excuse me, do you have a moment to talk about our real Lord and Savior? The Day of Reckoning is coming, says the voice on the other line. But did I, did I guess I picked up the phone. Puts an accent on the you real. Definitely... Hello, are you still there? Uh, no, I'm not. Okay. Oh. Oh, what's all, what's all this then? Oh. Oh, every room is connected by vents coming from the unused boiler room. Could it be? Well, time to investigate the boiler room. The oh boiler no, it's room. Freddy. <laughs> it's Freddy Krueger. Oh, isn't this like an SCP? I think it is. I think yeah. this is they have like an SCP off of this. You enter you the dark, enter the bo dark boiler room and trip over the pipe. Cursing, you find a light switch and gasp in horror. It's not a pipe at all. It's a long, rubbery arm, coiling around the room and ending in a ventilation shaft. Coming closer, you can smell something vile and rotten. Drake has been here. Well, better check, check the, the vent. vent or Sharpie. What? You almost fall uh! to the ground when you see the wide-open stale of the dead pervert, his elongated limbs stretching and disappearing into the... Vents darkness. Inside his mouth, you find a tiny key. <laughs> Godspeed, little pervert. After the police arrive, the whole building gets searched. Following the arms, the detectives find the body of a man stuck in the ventilation shaft. Later, he is identified as the building caretaker. Inside, in his closet, police find pieces of underwear and voyeuristic photos of the tenants. Ew. You are questioned thoroughly and eventually released as the murder case is covered up as a case of an unfortunate gas leak. Ending A. 
30 experience, 15 experience, minus 5 doom, and one day of time passing. So we gave a thorough investigation. I wonder if uh, that's because we did the side quest. Oh, dangerous bands of rioters are gathering around downtown. The police are hopeless. Good, I guess. All right, so. All right, what's it doing here? All right, so oh, do we have two small keys now? I think nice. so. It says we still have the one. Huh. Either way, uh, so you are not currently in this. Oh, right, we had to. Um, okay, so we have um, we have pretty good stamina right now, but our reason's taking a little bit of a hit. I think we should rest um, somehow. Yeah, what's... Our doom is at 12%, but... Yeah, it went down you know, from, we've from got 17. Five mysteries. So that's 20% per mystery. So as long as we're taking less than 20% doom per mystery, probably okay. Nothing in storage now. Um, what did you just do? Uh, saved. Oh, okay. You calm down and do wonders for your sore muscle. Reason regained. Oh yeah, we want re we want to get our reason back, right? Yes. Okay. Well, that didn't increase our doom. That wasn't oh, we a got, ton. We got the uh, key on on the on the D now. Oh, okay. D key. Oh, you've already... Okay, so you can only take a bath once. Gotcha. Cool. Holy, should we peep through the peephole? I guess. Are you still there? Oh, uh... Oh, oh. uh you're not fooling me. We saw you. Fucking asshole. Oh, what's that? What's Open drawer. drawer. Night library notes. Library notes. Uh, gain a random Please. spell, but lose one to two reason. Okay, cool. I'll hold on to that for now. Let's let's, let's put that yeah. in storage. I don't feel like using up my reason right now, and I don't want it taken up because I only have four inventory slots. Right. Um, where's storage? There we go. Storage. Cool. Uh, hold on to the key. Start a new mystery. What's watch TV? So cool. Why is why do I have a brick phone? Because it's 1980x. Well, it's 1984 actually. Oh, uh, okay. That's the year I was born. Except uh. like in December, but still. All right, well, I guess the TV didn't do I anything. Didn't really do anything. Okay, so we got the ramen oh, we got one. Ramen. Vigil. The vigil. The cape. And the arms already taken up, and then whatever this is. Is that a new one to the right of the arms? No, no it's not. Okay. So I'm. So I guess we have to. Yeah. Do the other three first. I'm guessing. All right, which one do you want to do? The vigil, the ramen, or the cape? Uh, let's do the ramen one. Let's see what that is. That that one is. Out of thin air, a brand new ramen restaurant opens up in town. It's adored by everyone. Once people take a bite, they can't stop. Day and night, the queues stretch out the door. The shambling customers stuff themselves with dish after dish while the blind owner sits silently behind the counter, grinning and polishing his gleaming knives. Oh, this is like a Sweeney Todd ramen shop? <laughs> you, are so deter you are determined to discover what makes this ramen so enticing. What is its true power? Dog meat, human meat, the flesh of the gods themselves. It's cilantro. Okay, watching the local news, you spot a familiar street. It's a fami it's a feature about the newest ramen shop. The food critic has a manic look as he describes the ramen. The description makes your stomach churn. Dumpster dive. Discard two item cards to complete the this quest. Okay, I guess that's just a side okay. quest then. 
I don't feel like doing that. I like my items, thank you very much. <laughs> okay, so... I guess downtown? Yeah, we should probably go downtown. And start investigating. Start finding this ramen shop. The only metro line in your town connects the university and the silence, science complex. You should take a ride to gain some time. The silence complex. Uh, but you've got the feeling something is wrong. Where are all the people? Take a ride or decide to walk. Hmm. Buy the ticket, take the ride. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna complain about... Ooh, oh, no! Failure. There are no lights inside the metro car. All you can see are countless handprints pressed under the windows. Minus two reason. Well, there goes the oh, reason yeah. we just got back. Yeah, there goes... I, you spoiled my bath. Bruh. Well, it's still circling apartments. So let's see if we yeah, find something here. I don't understand here. why that. You try to avoid mirrors, afraid of what could be waiting for you on the other side. I find this wasn't really easy. Mr. Zero Zero Zero, the, your your neighbor is a, a horror manga artist. He's struggling to come up with a satisfying ending for his new story. Oh my! Your my experience, experience is come up. Yeah, it says to gain a new level, press the flashing button. I think you might need to complete the. Oh no! Choose one perk and one stat upgrade. So we got Fast Swimmer, Running Shoes, and Outdoorsman. What do they do? Uh, plus one luck. Plus one luck. Okay. Smaller Doom penalty from running from combat. Well, I haven't run from combat yet, so I don't know. Yeah. I don't run from no combat. Faster offensive action. Faster actions. offensive action. That seems useful. Yeah, I'll, I'll keep that. And you get to pick a perk to go up. Strength, dexterity, perception, knowledge, charisma, luck, stamina, and stamina, stamina, and reason. Well, I, hmm. I don't want to, you know, pick one of the health stats just to refill it. I don't even know if it will refill it, or if it just gives me the max. Um, right. I, what kind of checks have we been running into so far? There's been a lot of luck, luck. checks. Um, I've seen a charisma check. There's been and then like one, physical at checks. Least one dexterity check. Yeah. I mean, my physical my physical stats are pretty good. Right. Um. I think I'll supplement my knowledge because it's pretty low right now. Okay. All right. So we chose fast swimmer and knowledge. Okay. So what do we do with our friend, the struggling well, Freddie Mercury artist? I think it's supposed to be Junji Ito, but, like, Junji Ito oh, doesn't no, have I a mustache. Is. Does he have a mustache? I don't think he has a mustache. I don't think so. I don't know. I'll share my experience with him. Not enough XP. Oh. Public won't experience the same horror you did. The only true way to investigate is to get into the restaurant yourself. I'm assuming that it's downtown. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Oh, hello there! <laughs> a woman bumps into you as she runs from a beauty parlor. Before you can say anything, you notice her face. She's carved out her own eyes. <laughs> okay, point of order. How do we know she carved out her own eyes? How do we know not know someone else carved out the eyes for her? Look, where we're going, we won't need eyes to see. <laughs> if I can't see it, it can't see me, right? You shudder, seeing a faint vision of Goizo reflected in the beauty parlor's mirrors. Minus two stamina. I guess because she bumped into me. Ooh. Uh, all right, keep investigating downtown. I don't know why the apartments are circled, but... Yeah. Here we go. You can see here, uh -oh. hear a faint sobbing sound from an alley nearby. There you approach a man on his knees. When you take a step closer, he suddenly stops and perks up. You can hear the nauseating sound of tearing skin. 
Hey, oh. Fight. oh god. Oh. Glued corpse. Don't like that. All right. Um We still got our uh our our bottle, right? Sure enough do. Yeah, we have it we do. We do have the bottle collected oh. uh equipped. Okay, cool. Um Luckily, it's, uh, our offensive, uh, stuff is beefed up a little bit because of the Fast Swimmer perk. Nice. Uh, let's see, I guess I want to... He got 21 hit points. I guess it has 21 hit points. Okay, and I have 70 base chance to hit. But I can still do, like, even if I prepare my attack and, and do an attack boost, I can still get two attacks in. Like, I can get three attacks in. Alright, let's do that. Nice. Let's, let's do it again. I think I can... I, okay, that's, that's what these mean. I think I can save my... It's uh... so, like, if I do this, and I hit L3... I can mm -hmm. save that combat sequence, and I can ah. use it again later as like a quick thing. Macros, nice. Okay. All right. Um. I know it's gonna cost Doom to enter. But I do want to rest. And like you were saying, as long as it's... I, I, like, by the end of this chapter, as long as it's under 40, we should be okay. Right. You see, I keep wanting to investigate the restaurants because it's circled. Or the apartments. Yeah, I think I'm I'm cheating a little bit by googling this. Oh but, no, uh, please! I think we actually do want to be investigating the circled location. Okay. Um, the circles. What? Yeah, you 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 want to be investigating the circled location unless the side quest involves going somewhere other than the circled location. Okay. Essentially, or if the, excuse me. Or if the other areas, like, have some place we want to go, if, like, if we want to buy something. If the, yes, or if the threat level at the circled location is really high, and you need to find a way to bring it down first. Understood. I, yeah, I was looking up, <laughs> I was looking up a few tips, because I'm like, why is that circled? I need to find out. And, yeah, it is sort of a. Yes, that's sort of like a guide. Yeah, I I, um, I don't mind getting spoiled on things like that because it's just basic game mechanics that I probably should know. Yeah. Uh, I do want to see the shop for... I want to see the... Cause I know that there's a dog that runs the shop. There he is. It's a Shiba. Oh my god, it's a doge. It's a little Shiba Inu. JSR, come get your boys. Oh, we can get a flashlight, salt, a compass, a steak knife, and a camera. Um, I'm sorry, game. Ca I'm sorry. A zero out of ten. The camera is not a weapon, in reference to Fatal Frame. Oh, it is an equipment though. <laughs> um, it does help in combat. I'm willing to allow that at least. Fair enough. Fair enough. As if it's if it aids in combat, then I'm I'm willing to allow it as. So uh... we we have four money. Um. Oh, we do. So that's a slot B, that's a slot C. Um, that's a usable item that deals damage to ghosts. And that's a slot B. See, I was thinking salt would be like a protection item. Because you're always, you know, in horror stories about like a circle of salt I think, to like repel demons. I, I think that the, um, that that's still kind of represented here. Um cuz 
I kind of do want to get we like a... to find. Go. We need to find Kiryu to get our Yakuza card. Yeah, we do. Majima's everywhere. Um, <laughs> like that's the actual threat level. <laughs> Um, Majima with like just a giant spiral <laughs> in the middle of his face. Where we're the going? Steak knife doesn't seem that great, honestly. I mean, no, I'm not. I'm not going to get the steak knife. We already have the broken bottle, um, so I'm not worried oh, about. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. I was... um, okay, it does three damage. It does three damage. Is it the same damage? The same chance to yeah. hit. Um, Our. Uh... The, the razor and the bat did four damage. This has a four, this yeah. has a higher speed. I don't know if that's that's good or bad, but like it's done well so far, so I don't really care. I'm assuming the speed affects um, how long the action is when you set it in the combat. So like I, something with a higher speed, you can probably attack more times in a turn. So I'm primarily looking at like the slot B and C stuff. Mm -hmm. Um, and there's one slot C oh my thing. God, the little bar. <laughs> Arf, arf. Um, the uh, compass. the compass is the only uh, slot C thing we have, so I could get that. But Two like... experience for each investigated location. Yeah. I wonder if that's per mystery, so you could get you could do an investigation once around the map and get well, that's how an, many locations that's there an are. That, like... That's an equipped item, so it's it's um, but I assume it's throughout the entirety of the game while I have it equipped. Right, but I'm thinking, um, like, can you only get it for each location once, or can you do it for each mystery, is my thing. Oh, so I don't I, know. You can investigate every location at the start of a mystery, get some bonus XP, and then do it again on the next mystery for I'm... more bonus XP. XP. I mean, seeing as it's an equipable thing, I'm assuming that it's like every time you investigate, you can get plus two experience. Okay. Um... But I'm just kind of torn between the flashlight or the camera. Like, plus one perception. Well, this actually gives plus one knowledge, and it gives me the combat action, so I'll probably go with the camera. We have had... Uh, I will point out that we have had one instance where there was uh, an option we couldn't take because we didn't have a light source, and the flashlight is a light source. But yeah, I mean, it's, um, it's entirely up although, to you. Although, yeah, we, we did just raise our knowledge, and we haven't been dodging. We've been attacking the entire time. Mm -hmm. I'll, I'll go with the flashlight. Okay. No, dog, come back. My compass. Um. Oh, there's new stuff. There's new stuff now. That's medicine. Oh, I, don't want, one I don't want minus one charisma. I don't want minus charisma. That seems like a that seems like a real rough. Trade. No, I'm gonna. I'm gonna stat permanently for temporary health boost. Yeah, I'm gonna think I'm gonna stick with the compass. <laughs> all right. Cool. All right, we're broke now. That's fine. We have equipment. Um. Cool. Got. Yeah. All right. So back to the apartments. We're already there. Well, so we've got a bottle, a flashlight, and a compass. Oh, yeah, let's check on the neighbor. No, they're busy. No, you suck. How about, what if I use this broken bottle on you? Now, do you want to talk? Tell me about the restaurant. A woman jumps out of her apartment covered in gore. <laughs> Between sobs, she tries to explain what happened. She was taking a shower when suddenly the shower head started spraying blood. A trail of blood leads into the dark apartment. All Danzig. <laughs> Uh... You get blood to go up the walls. <laughs> I know what you're referencing. Um... Aqua Teen Hunger Force? I, yeah, Cybernetic Ghost of Christmas Pass. That's elfin blood. Uh, should we, should, we, should we calm her down or check the bathroom? Uh... My... Uh, my instinct is to go into the bathroom and see... What's going on? Oh, by the way, we got um, we got two experience. You can see at the bottom there. Your compass helps you find your uh... way plus two experience. So, already paying dividends. Uh, it's up to you though. If you want to stay and calm her down, um, either works for me. 
Let's check the bathroom. After all, we did just get this flashlight. Knowledge check. Knowledge success. check. Success. You didn't enter the bath. You don't enter the bathroom. Instead, you go straight to the bo bo uh, building's boiler room. Uh, we already did something with that, though. That was the arm. One pipe coming from the ground looks like it was welded into the central system. Where does it lead? Well, that's because, you know, the oh, no. arm, they had to replace it. It seems you're not the only one wanting to try it for yourself. You stayed in line for hours. Your questions fall on deaf, e deaf ears, and you're shunned. Oh, no. Well, I guess we got to investigate downtown. Oh, now. now it's downtown. Yep, okay. Yeah, the circle tells you where to investigate, basically. The investigation is taking a toll on you. You start to miss the most obvious leaves. Plus four doom. Uh-oh. Yet. Is that blood you smell? <laughs> Sweet blood. Something is wrong. You don't see anyone on the street. You could have sworn it was crowded just a minute ago. You better hurry out of there. Minus one reason. Finally, your turn to order. One ramen, please. Through the, uh, the uh, through the dirty restaurant window, you notice a shady-looking man wearing a, sim a jacket covered in strange symbols. He stops in front of a house, visibly nervous. Before he enters the house, he turns around as if he's checking for any unwanted followers. What could it mean? Follow the weird man, call the police, or do nothing. Hmm. I mean, I'm thinking follow him. Perception oh. check failure, but I just got a flashlight. The door is locked, but you think you can repeat the knocking pattern of the suspicious man you use. Nothing happens. Plus 2% doom. Oh no! So much doom! The Red Bull is pushing your face. It's so crowded that you're forced to sit on the floor. No ramen restaurant is that fucking popular. I'm sorry. Walking through the park, you find a little girl crying alone on the playground. When you ask what's wrong, she says that she can't find her mommy. Luckily, you spot the girl's address on a backpack lying nearby. Let's take her home. Of course we take the girl home. You offer to take her home. When you get there, the terrified mother slams the door in your face. From behind the door, she starts screaming to get the little girl away. The little girl calmly tells you that she can take it from here. Plus 10 experience, minus 2 stamina. Uh, creepy. Hey, we got 10 experience. That's pretty nice. Oh, here we go. With a slick hand, you fill mm. a vial of soup and walk out without tasting the weird dish. Investigate lab. Uh, this definitely seems like we're... Lab results. With the pulling of some delicate strings, you get the ramen into a lab. While handing over the gathered material, you hesitate. What should you send into the laboratory? Well, I mean, the only thing we can send. We don't have any option. A mere day later, your friend rings your door. Her face is pale and in a shaky hand. She holds an analysis sheet. You usher her in and bolt the door. You feel ill looking at the charts. While they couldn't identify some of the particles, they did discover a highly addicted drug in the broth. The ramen restaurant must be closed immediately. It's crack. <laughs> a week later, police and, cocaine in the ramen. <laughs> police and government officials are looking over where the ramen restaurant used to be. Nothing remains but a gap in the street and aimless, confused customers. You'd like to believe that that was the end of it, but snippets and newspapers from other cities unsettle you. Brief articles about an exciting new ramen restaurant opening and its mysterious owner keep showing up. You can no longer eat noodles without feeling ill. We got ramen B. Rewards for salt. And we got ending B. We got 30 experience, minus 5% doom, and one day of time pass. Man... Remember when that sweet ramen restaurant with the crack in it opened up and some bitch had to ruin it for everybody? Look, I just think it's funny. Y'all got any more of that ramen? <laughs> I just think it's funny. Like, we're thinking that so there's something paranormal going on, and it just turns out they put drugs in it. <laughs> and that's all it was. I mean, yeah, they disappeared real quick and started opening up in other places, and that's kind of creepy. But that's all it seems to be is that, yeah, we just put fucking stimutax in your fucking ramen. <laughs> Yes. This this ramen. <laughs> when I eat this ramen, I can feel the sun god within me. <laughs> Marduk, son of Ea, slayer, slayer of Tiamat. Tiamat. 
If I eat more ramen, there won't be any room left for Marduk, Slayer of Tiamat. I have the energy of a bear that has the energy of two bears. <laughs> oh, the old god oh, stirs. Yeah. Uh -oh. Blood Moon. The Crimson Moon splotted, splotted over Shiokawa keeps everyone on edge. I don't know. All the enemies are going to respawn. <laughs> uh, what does this do? All enemies get additional 20 it's power. Additional 20 power. Oh, shit. Alright, well. All right, okay, we got the B key. Alright, may as well take a bath. Um, try to get some more reason back. Look on the, um, the cabinet again. No, oh, nothing, nothing in there in this there. time. Okay. Cool. Alright, so we've got 12 reason. Uh, Doom went back down to 35. Uh, so we're, we're still... okay. We're doing okay. Uh, I'm not this too worried. This is our first run. This is our first attempt at it. Oh, for for never having done... Oh, hey. Yeah, I don't think I want to keep that open. For never having done this before, we're doing okay. You know, a little low on reason. Doom is a little high, but... Uh, it's okay. We'll probably get, get better with time, and we may, like, do another playthrough of this. Um, oh, yeah. Let's check out the TV and the people. I'm already says, getting into the rhythm of it. A minor earthquake in the seaside region has revealed an entrance to a partially flooded cavern system. Local scientists believe some of the corridors could be man-made. What does choose an action? Um. <laughs> oh, that part, uh, oh, it means um from over here. Oh, okay. People. Oh, okay. I didn't see anything that no, time. There's Did you. Nothing there, but we know you're there. Bill. <laughs> Fucking Bill. I know you're out there, Paul McCartney. <laughs> Paul McCartney. Here, when you put your... But I'm not out here. Oh, you can quietly hear... Desmond has a trolley in the marketplace. But, but I'm not out here. <laughs> I'm not out here. You can't see me, I'm not out here. That's my Paul McCartney impression. Hey, that's better than my Paul McCartney impression would be. <laughs> All right. Uh, oh, that's save and exit. Uh, I mean, it is like quarter to ten. Um, oh, is it? Damn, this flew by. Um, but this is this is rad as hell. Yeah, this is awesome. I'm loving I'm this. I'm digging the hell out of this. So, I, I what the I'm um? Totally gonna buy this game, by the way. Holy shit! Yeah, this it's right is up my alley. this is available. I have the Switch version, but it is available on Steam and all your consoles and stuff that you want to play it on. So I think the um the plan moving forward is I'm gonna focus on this, um, and we're gonna put Shin Megami Tensei on hold for the time being. Okay. Um, and then either um once I'm done with my uh, Archipelago project. Uh, I mean, uh -huh. um, and my speed runs that I want to do, I'm either going to resume Shin Megami Tensei then by myself, or uh, if Greg wants to play Shin Megami Tensei more, we can start it up again after we're done with World of Horror. Um, but uh, either way, uh, Shin Megami Tensei will be back. Um, oh, absolutely. We just need to we need to put that away for a little bit. Yeah, for a little while. We need to recover from that. But um, I am I'm definitely looking forward to playing this some more. This is like as oh, I hell yes. as I mentioned this, this is, is awesome. this is rad as hell and I love it. And uh, I hope uh, that you love it too and that you'll um Stick yeah. With us. We'll just watch more of us playing this game cuz uh, <laughs> I can't wait to see what happens next. So uh, so until then I've been Captain Floofers. And I'm Sonic Greg. And we'll be here next time. Join us, won't you?